Hi, this is Ronnie from the Smith Shire. Today I'm going to show you our processing setup and uh, then we'll show you actual some invisceration and stuff. So this is the hand washing station. This is full of hot water. We got some soap, we got a nail brush, um, and we have paper towels here. Um, next we're going to show you the actual cooling section. So our birds are in here. We've already did a prayer of gratitude. We've got some incense burning here. Um, the birds come out of there and we give them a final flight, which we'll demonstrate in a little while. From there they go into the calling cone. We have a very specialized uh, scalpel. It's curved, so you can cut just the two arteries. This has bleach water in it, but it doesn't yet. I have to clean this still. But so they go in here, you do two little cuts, you let them bleed. And then from here they go into the scalding pot. We've got some very specialized gloves. These are super great. Um, you can get them on Amazon. Highly recommend it. They're super textured. I don't know if you can see that. Really great for agitation and removing the feathers. From there, they go to the um, deep, the deep feather plucker thing. It's got sprayers, and then you can all, and then you turn it on and it spins. And then the feathers come out down there. Oops, I forgot to turn the water off. From there they go over here into one of the dirty buckets and then this is this is already cool well water that's been tested for microbes and there it comes here we remove the head neck and feet for our dogs again bleach water it's 100 parts per million we have a special neck container and then we have heads and feet down there the dogs love them also and we have a second dirty water also cold water from there, birds are picked up, brought to the evisceration station here. This has been all bleached. There's bleach water in here with a sprayer. Um, I have a couple of finger bowls that I use just to keep my hands clean. Um, this is a scrubby. When they have sweat on them, it's really good. And then that also is helpful for um, loosening up pin feathers and stuff. Then I have a couple more containers here. I use this one for the gizzards because those will need to be cleaned separate. Um, livers and hearts going here and then at the end the kidneys and all the little stuff I spray out the bird and I leave it in here and this is really great for the cat. She, she'll eat all the things but she really likes the little jibs. From there it goes into another, this is the clean tank and it's cold and these handles are bleached as is the top of the lid. From there it goes to, this is our um, packing station. Um, we built this little apparatus out of PVC. We spray it down with some bleach spray. Put the birds on there, let them dry a little while, and then put the shrink wrap bag on them. And then from there they get shrunk in the hot water and into the coolers. And that's it in a nutshell. We'll show you more in a little bit.